Calamari's on the menu. I thought that was supposed to do things! Indiana Jones! Chocolate rain! Pours down from that large old sewer drain. Chocolate rain. Zombie tadpoles trying to eat my brain. Chocolate rain. Oh, God. Oh, no. Keep forgetting to re-record this part because it gets copyright. I mean, I don't know why I care because I play all sorts of songs during my stream, whatever. But maybe I'll help if I do it earlier in the stream and not later. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. Friday night. And we're feeling just right. Oh, what a night. Man, that came in hot and heavy, didn't it? The blade signal is up, folks. Boomtown is open. Battle axes are being passed out. Sword sharpened. Boomsticks loaded. Flannel pressed. I am wearing my workout shirt because I did not have not time. I did not have time from to this today's show to then go and work out and also cook supper and then get back here in time to take a shower. So you got sweaty blade. You got sweaty right out of the gym blade. We are playing a brand new game. If we end up enjoying it, we may pick up the full release, but it's a $70 game. It came out of nowhere. And as you can see here, it's getting really good reviews. 4.87, almost a perfect score out of almost 4,000 reviews on PlayStation. And I think it's only available on PlayStation. I tried looking it up on Steam. Couldn't find it. So, because tonight will be the night that I will fall for you over again. Don't make me change my mind. That's how you know JoJo's here. JoJo has her own ring music. How do you pick out members of the League of Blades to do your hiring for your monster slaying and your do-goodery and your justice spreading? It's all about branding and presentation. It's important to have a brand so when there's nine League of Blades members standing side by side, they'll say, which one did the song? Where'd my chat go? Yeah, there it goes. Whatever. Which one of y'all got the song? And then it's JoJo's got the song. Which one of y'all says, welcome to the rice field, mother effers? Yeah. Yeah. One, two, That's the one right there. Sweet and sexy. Five, six, Nike oh, yeah. Kicks. oh yeah, nice and sweaty. That was that would be a good interest song. If you guys want to support the broadcast, if you guys want to support a worthy cause, if you guys want to support the declaration that is all come. evil shall be slain. I mean, I I knew you would come, but you've come. Oh yeah. I have. Come. I was told to be here. Well, I wasn't told to be here. I told you guys I would be here and we're here now. Friday night, we're pouring blade brews. Oh yeah, refreshing, refreshing. We're gonna fight some monsters, we're gonna slay some evil. If you wanna support the show, the best way to do it, we don't run ads here. You get an ad when you come in the stream, that's a YouTube thing, and then from the rest of the broadcast, as long as you don't exit the broadcast, you'll never get another ad the whole stream. Ain't that awesome? If you wanna support the broadcast, best way to do it, some super chats, becoming a member and tribute Tribute 
to the League of Blades, Nicole, with the first Super Chat of the night. Ten bones. Nine dollars, ninety-nine cents from Gen 2 Boobs Kern. I have also come. That's good. Mission accomplished. Blade makes all the bladies come. Ain't that what you want? Ain't that what you want to hear? Ten bones and ten bones back to back to fuel the blade bonfire so that all the heroes see that we've called for aid and that we're out here on the front lines fighting the evil, slaying the monsters, looking good doing it. I came, I saw, and I came again. I'm going to get you some Pedialyte, my friend. Thank you so much to Gen 2 Boobs, and thank you so much to Nicole Martyr, back-to-back double-digit donos. Thank you for tributes. Thank you for supporting the League of Blades. Hey, Jamie. Hello, Brian. Hello, Jen. Hello, Atreyu. Let's see who's answered the call. Hello, Jared Magic Man. Hello, Melton. Hello, Dan. Doth mine eyes behold a Brenda? I think I'd be Brenda if I wasn't Blade. Yeah. I think if I had a lady name, it'd be Brenda. Probably. Either that or... Belinda? What's up, Snazzy? Hello, Steven. Hello, Boatwright. Hello, David. Hello, Tiffany. Hello, Catherine. What's up, Morgan? Hello, Barely Legal. Hello, Cat. Let us begin. Stellar Blade may be the new Brenda Blade. Let's see if she's worthy of the title of Blade Master. Let's find out. Let's get into our feature presentation here. <laughs> BBS. You'd make a pretty solid Gabriel? I don't know where I was. Ten dollars from Jordan Bannon and Lady George. Insert funny cum and cool water and tire. Cool water. <laughs> I've been th hey James, I've been thinking about turning off the Biden voice to for not to like get rid of the announcement just to switch it up because we've been doing Biden now for like a month but I look really forward to seeing you guys type something in the comments and then listen to him butcher it who who lauder who lot him Jojo you're so full of personality you don't have to try thank you so much to Jojo for the 10 dollar super chat thank you for your tribute to the league of blades tribute tribute i like your sweaty hair well that's all that matters bad boat right i made a year and i came that's good mark carpenter 11 months a blade master these two have stood and sworn their allegiance once again to the world's greatest group of heroes ever a tribute titties don't get me hot on a friday night you won't like what you see there'll be a lot of grunting hey parker 12 months and 11 months respectively to our two blade masters thank you guys thank you all very much happy friday night hey parker let's see what this game's all about i heard there's a lot of anime titties in this and when i looked up tags for this game one of the tags that i saw that was most common was jiggle physics so this ought to be a lot of fun anguish i have seen some shit man i kid you not i have seen some shit i think people that have seen shit don't talk about it much i've seen everything the worst of the worst and i just i think that's why i'm able to stay calm in crazy situations i think that's important that you do hard things because the harder things that you do makes everything else easy so the, all the hard, terrible, awful shit that I've seen in my life just makes little trivial things just like, I could be laying somewhere with a knife in my gut, but I'm not. I'm in an air-conditioned room drinking beer. <laughs> That's not so bad. Hey, Bernie. Hey, Alan. A saving message pops up at the lower left screen when auto-saving. All right. 
The demo version of Stellar Blade, you can play a portion of the game's first section. If you play the full game to complete the demo, the saved data will sync. Ooh, that's good. That's good. I need it. So that's Mars, and that's the title screen. Mars is made up mostly of mountain ranges and water, and it's a smooth 60 degrees, a smooth 65 degrees with overcast all the time on Mars. This game takes place in outer space, by the way. I could do normal mode or story mode. Let me move my guy, who is me. <laughs> Let me move myself up top. We'll, I'm sure I'll probably end up having to move myself back down again, but we'll move myself up top for now just to see how the game looks with me up here. I'll probably end up having to move myself again here in a second, but we'll keep us up there for now. Mm. Do you have daddy issues? Well, technically I'm a daddy, so maybe I can fix your daddy issues. Very good. Let us begin! Normal mode's got intense combat, it says. One year on the red tube. Transmitting final briefing. Eagles fly. Now, Tree is returned. Four leaves once again. Alpha Nativas occupying District 3. Their nope. objective is the capture or dispatchment of the Elder Nativa. Is that a tampon? Entering atmosphere. One minute until threshold is reached. Well, this is a cool shot. Pop girls have daddy issues. Good. The threshold has been surpassed. Activating shield. Pew, pew, pew. Yeah, we got a lot of big bada boom boom. Hey, Cheryl. What a shot. None of those guys made it, but that's still pretty cool. This is pretty. Not as pretty as you guys. Ah, oh god. That ain't good. Oh. Owie! What do I want that zoomed in on my mouth? My supple, moist. Plump mouth. Zero seven five three one. Pod landing complete. Perfect Remove landing. Physical shield. Opening hatch. Deploying boo physics. Activating sword mechanics. Hatch. Come on, come on. Uh oh. I'm doing it, bro. Oh, yeah. What? Did I lose the first thing in the game? Scotty. Eve, are you all right? This place is dangerous. Take my hand. <laughs> Overly dramatic reach. Ew. Ew! I'm being born! But in the most exotic and cool fashion ever! Uh-oh. 
What the hell fire is that thing? This Hot diggity dog! This place is magnificent! <laughs> I don't know how the audio sounds, so I don't... Holy tentacle hentai. The name of the game is Stellar Blade. Great. Coordinates? The rendezvous point is at 2 o'clock. 400 meters in front of us. This, uh, you can get the demo on PlayStation, or you can get the full game. This way. Sorry, I was exploring. A dead hot chick! I must save her life! Blow on every hole till something happens. That, well, she's gone. There's so many dead chicks. It's a travesty. Oh, there's guys fighting over here. I gotta go help. It does have a Bayonetta feel to it, yeah. Which I love Bayonetta. That was close. The hair movement? Hey, Manhattan. Watch out! It's an unlisted Tiba. I'll handle this one. Watch out! There's more. You don't understand how much. Elden Ring I have played. You Great. have no idea. What well, system been on? The PlayStation 5. You have no idea how much Elden Ring I have played. Are you right, you? Uh, my body frame. Take this. You're very welcome. Thank you. Nice parry. You taught me everything I know. There's more of them. Oh, shit! <laughs> Get in deep. Cut the gut. Steal their soul. Let that booty shake. Plug the hole. Ow. Nice. This is pretty fantastic so far. If you like Final Fantasy 3, bro, it's right up your alley, buddy. 50 caliber shaped potions. This game was made for the League of Blades. Explosions. Wonderful music. Hot chicks. Lots of gameplay with swords. That piece is incredible. This way. Who gave you this number? Mike, you look to the sky. You look to the sky and see the blade signal. Whoa! <laughs> well, that's what I get for enjoying the atmosphere and enjoying the set piece. You secured Point in sight. Am I supposed to cut through it, I think? This way. I'm coming! <laughs> okay. Holy crap, there's so much going on. Oh, shit! What the heck? Is this the demo? Yes, this is the demo. Don't stop. Keep moving, Ian. So many dead hot chicks laying around. Close. Good evening. This isn't looking good. Let's go. Our first boss, and he's surrounded by angels. An alpha nativa. Let's join them. Let's do it. Glorious battle. Uh oh. 
I was robbed of my boss fight. Where will I hang the trophy now? Stupid skyship. I was expecting her arm to be missing or something. Hair <laughs> no! She's wearing a tie, which is badass. No. Oh no, all of our sisters. Our battle sisters. We're the only two left. Still hot. And the bodies are still warm, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Darn it. Is this sucker punch? It looks like it. Eve. Eve, pull yourself together. I'm a sucker for chokers. I love chokers. Turkey. Scotty, I know it's a common mispronounce. We haven't completed our mission. Now it's just up to us to see this mission through. How come her sword's so big and understand? cool? I understand. I guess if I have to. That guy didn't die. Eve, are you ready? <laughs> yes, for good luck. All right, Liga Blaze, we weren't cheated after all. Here we go. Gizzard's hanging out. Teamwork. That's me and the League of Blades right there. Teamwork, baby. Also... It wasn't an alpha, but it was a strong one. You fought well. Even better than during training. Thank you, Jen. You were all together. But then... Hot. <laughs> oh no, my back! Your body frame is serious. We have to find the supply camp. Let's be best friends forever. I love you. Wait, Eve. I hear something. Yeah. Eve! <laughs> Is that like a, a butterfly missile? Or a bee rocket? Eve, are you alright? You're really babysitting me and I appreciate it. I'm not doing too hot. What is it? It's like a harpy, but... With sickle claws. Here, friend. It's me you want. <laughs> Whoa. No, don't do it! You need that for two arm stuff. You need that for living. Eve, get out of here. Okay. Ducky! Hmm. 
Man, talk about getting your hooks into somebody. Wow. Whoa. Literally. The game got its hooks into me, and that harpy mama got her hooks deep into our sister friend. Lover? Bird kill dummy mommy. <laughs> that <laughs> So much was said there. Did you guys know this? Wiener. Did you guys know that this is just the last of us in the future? Joel's going to show up in a second. Because he's still alive in my world. I'll never play that second game, damn it. It's quiet. Still, make sure to stay cautious. I swear the Alpine AT by us. Don't fall asleep. You too. The highlighted boobies? That's the most I've ever seen Thad get excited before. Harpy titties? I always say all boobs are good boobs, but I don't know about harpy boobs. No, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. Are you serious? You go kick their ass. I'll go home. <laughs> good evening, Marcelo. Welcome to our adventure. Cool shoes! So this must be eight or seven. And I'm a robot. Yes. This was the final battlefield of civilization. I never played Code Vein because also and no we're the reason. Three best friends city. that anybody could have. We're the three best friends that anyone could have. We're the three best friends Something that anyone can sky. have. A strange sensation. It's called rain. This must be Earth's rain. Oh yeah, you've never been to Earth, have you? We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. Terrain data has changed recently. Data bank, Tachi. So Tachi is was our partner, which we didn't see her die. We just saw her lose the arm and then get some gut rearrange mint. Hello, Kenneth. Tachi is the commanding officer of the seventh airborne squad. They say that in the colony combat simulations, her speed was unmatched. She wasn't fast enough, was she? No, maidens. Wrong one. She wasn't fast enough, was she? Skill issue. That's the one. <laughs> hey, Misty. <laughs> she wasn't fast enough, was she? <laughs> she got she got Luke Skywalker. Yeah, she did. Her 7th Airborne Squad gets obliterated by not night. I about said the other N-word. Not that N-word, but the other N-word. The one from 1940. When entering the Earth's atmosphere. Hello, Davis. However, the mission's still a go. Despite everybody getting smashed and harpies stabbed, the mission's still a go. Yet the Nat Natibas onslaught practically wipes out Tachi's squad to make matters worse. An unidentified Natyaba, which is the harpy thing, Strikes that warning, leaving both Tachi and Eve at death's door. So Tachi didn't die. In this desperate moment, Tachi sacrifices her. Never mind, she died. I needed to wait till I read the next sentence. This guy's name is Adam. He ain't got a lot going on. Adam's a scavenger from Xion. He saved Eve's life with an unidentified Natyaba. Although Eve did not trust him at first, Adam suggests that he and Eve work together. Yeah, sure. Those are the little guys running around that we fought called Thornheads. That's the dude that we kind of learned. These guys look incredible. Gruesomely twisted bodies. Bone saw blades. Wow. Is the game worth downloading? Uh, I mean, I've only played about 20 minutes of it, 10 minutes of it. So far, I'm enjoying it. I don't like the music. Reminds me way too much of anime. And you know how much I don't like anime. Phone booth? 
In this economy? Oh, fast travel. You're already at this location, of course. This is kind of like the Matrix where you use... We've seen way worse on this game. Or on this channel. Well, the game looks incredible. The music's very Final Fantasy. I don't like that, but that's just me. I'm not a Final Fantasy guy. Thank you, Adam. Something is coming. Better watch it. <laughs> hey, man, to each their own. Whatever floats your boat. It just isn't for me. If nothing else, this game is absolutely taking advantage of the hardware available on the PlayStation. The game looks fantastic. Here's this game for a while. Uh, so far the combat is a lot of fun. The characters are pretty cool. The story seems interesting. That was killed in the, final war. the game looks that just graphics alone. The game looks fantastic. Did I just put that sword back in my? Wait, did I put it back in my hair? It's holy crap! My sword is my hair bow. Wait for it. Bayonetta, eat your heart out. That was cool. Passcode R0AR0A. All right. There's an encrypted code in the stick. It's encrypted, of course. A type of entry permit. The guy gonna come to life. Nope. Try entering the cup. Oh crap. Oh, thank you, game. <laughs> I know we just picked it up, but I didn't write it down because this is all a bunch of hullabaloo gibberish. A R O A. Bingo. One hell of a scrunchie. Yeah. Like, I keep lock picks and stuff in my beard, but never a giant ass sword. Is that why? The whole planet just collapses and crushes, and it's all part of it. Yeah, it's just. The whole planet's unstable. You'll get used to it. Can I swim? Now that's dedication, Holmes. They don't normally put swimming in games. Also, I don't think I have an oxygen tank. Or like an oxygen meter because we're not actually human, we're robotic. So I can stay underwater as long as I want to. Graphics remind you of near Autonoma. So the description that I read about this earlier was that it was it was said Dark Souls meets near Autonoma. Maybe it was something else meets near Autonoma, but I, I read Dark Souls, I think. So far, there's no combos, though. The combat's pretty linear. That's the perfect description? Yeah. A very unique health bar? Oh, yeah.
This is made by Shift Up, the same company that made Nikki. Nikki. What is Nikki? Oh. Oh. Yep. Nikki got the victory. Yep. Get a heads up on that. Camps are places where you can save your progress and get some rest. You can activate them by obtaining bitcoins found near camps. A mobile game with great assets. <laughs> right down. Search Nikki. Search Nikki. Whatever, Mom. It's a mobile game. God. Nikki, something of Goddess of Victory. All right. If I'm going to play video games, I want to also have a boner, you know? That way I can get two birds with one stone. Hello, Xander. Tribute! From Nicole Martyr. The $3 Super Chat. Thank you very much, Nicole, for supporting the League of... Thank you very much, Nicole, for supporting the League of Blades. And supporting our cause of spreading some justice out here. Thank you, Nicole. It's your second Super Chat tonight. Thank you so much. All right, the game says, hint, activate the Legion camp. I don't have a Bitcoin, I don't think. Never mind, I had one all along. You mean to tell me that people that made a mobile game made this game and it looks and runs this smooth? Maybe Marvel Strike Force could learn a lesson. Okay. I got 100 gold. And I need... 300 more gold to get highly concentrated potion. A lingering potion. Shot grenade. Yeah, so I can't get anything just yet. But I'll be able to here pretty soon. What's up, Paul? Cheers, David. Good to see you, buddy. Glad you're here for some R&R. &R. So a little escape action. On the adventure tonight. Let's go find some gold. The game that did lie, or the company that did Lies of P was primarily a mobile game designer, too. Mobile gaming is the future, folks. Lies of P was my game of the year Why last year. Resting is part of any mission. You can't tell me what to do. I'm a strong, independent person. Guess I'll rest. Pull out a book and read it. Maybe play with your hair. Spit in my mouth. <laughs> cool bike, bro. No! You're impressed? I, I had no idea it was a mobile game. That's awesome. What's wrong? I had a nightmare. Uh, it's nothing. My gloves are too big. I'm pissed off about it. From here on, you have to stay alert. Can I change the music? Let's find out. Is it a gotcha game? Because I'm the same way. I spend probably about $10, $15 a month on Marvel Strike Force, and I shouldn't. I know better. But the FOMO is real. <laughs> and I like it, man. If it brings me enjoyment, who cares? If I enjoy it, who gives a shit? Let me enjoy my life, nerds. <laughs> All right, we can learn a new skill. Let's see what we can learn. We can learn how to attack. We can learn how to survive. And we can... Never mind. That's it.
It's not letting me go back to attack. That blows. You can use SP to learn skills. SP is acquired through defeating nanobots. Press X to confirm. So this is the perfect dodge. Press triangle. Completely evades enemy attacks. Upon successful perfect dodge, press tri Oh, okay. So if I do a perfect dodge, I can push triangle and do kind of like a... Revenge hit. The perfect dodge. Let's try it out. Let's get some training in. See if we can do this. Select a skill at the kiosk for training. You can also try out skills you haven't learned yet. I'd rather not. If you are not used to combat, try increasing your proficiency with various skills through training. Okay. Whoa! 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 Supposed to be dodging, but I'm practicing my parrying. There we go. There we go. One more try. Man, he's got little stutters. I'm not, I'm not picking up just yet. All right, not bad. He's got some stutter step into it. I'm not picking up. I'll get it. That's hot. That is hot. Oh, shit. All right. That thing was called a cricket slasher. Hey, babe. Oh, wow. Crickets are nativas that look like a hard mix of crickets and other living organisms. Their shells look like naked bodies. They can develop hard arms. Nice. Creepy. Did you drop any loot? Let's loot it. Do you think there's anything useful? Press up to currently select potion and press up to select the desired potion, okay? Well, it's Legion, so compatibility shouldn't be an issue. Instantly restores a lot of HP. Continuously restores HP. Let's do instantly restores a lot of HP. That's good. Lot HP. Sure oh, I will. Nothing left behind. This looks important, like I should open it. Anything? Yeah, more than a sword? Not that I know of. I have not looked at it for equipment. Nah, I don't have anything but a sword. I got nothing. There's nothing in the equipment or the gear. Yeah, I got nothing. Just my scrunchy sword. Probably get more. Oh yeah. Abe, be careful. Jump and hang from below. bars. If you fall, it's over. Oh yeah. He's right. Oh shit, David! I don't know why I screamed, David. He must have brought me great pain at some point in my life. Some guy named David. Swing. Remember all those years of acrobatics you took. Easy.
Press triangle to airstrike. It means maintain their stance or stance with balance. Balance displayed below the HP and shield gauges. You can knock enemies off balance performing a perfect parry. Perfect parry. Enemies that are completely off balance become groggy. Use retribution to deal. Ah, yeah. Get groggy, bitch. Can you guys believe that a scrunchie can do all that? Holy crap. Scrunchies are awesome. What in the hentai? Whoa, there's a dude behind them tentacles. Do you see it? Press. Wow. Oh, I messed up. I left a lot of gold behind. What am I thinking? What's up, Ryan? You're about to download this PS5? Yes, PS5 only. Unfortunately, I know a lot of folks don't play PS5. So there's a mechanic that you can use. If you guys didn't see that, you push the middle or the middle trackpad button, and it does an area scan to show you what you've missed picking up and where enemies might be hiding at, which is awesome. <laughs> Boo! Hey, man, you gotta get with it. You gotta get that Sony action. Gear is equipment that can improve Eve's combat capabilities. You can equip gear and gear sockets to boost your desired combat capability. You can access gear sockets in the equipment tab by pressing the options button. All right. Let's take a peek. We got the combo attack enhancement gear, which brings my power level up 14% on combo attacks. Let's do it. On your PC? Well, until, what game are we playing right now? Dragon's Dogma. Until Dragon's Dogma came out, I hadn't turned on my PlayStation 5 in maybe a year. Hey, Jesse. Welcome to our little adventure here, buddy. The reason I hadn't turned on my PlayStation is because I play everything on my PC. I prefer it on my PC. I prefer mouse and keyboard. But the reason why we played Dragon's Dogma on the PlayStation is to avoid all the performance issues. And then this just happened to come out on the PlayStation 5 also. So PlayStation's making a comeback, baby. I see you back here. Literally, my PlayStation just sits there and holds my hats. That's the only reason why I have it, to hold my hats. Oh, yeah, let's go back and buy some stuff. How far away is that, though? We can't get back. Press this to scan the drone the surrounding areas to locate hidden places. Kaboosh! Are other cities in a similar state? Hide and seek game time? Alright, you hide, I'll see. Pretty good. After the colony extinction, most places were nothing but dust. Mm. In the car? Let's open the car's oh, right. At least the fusion cell's intact. Oh, okay. We did this before, but we couldn't. There was nothing in it, I see. Fusion cell? It's a high energy compression battery. Thanks to that, Earth's night isn't dark yet. Oh, it's the previous generation of the infinity cell. Be sure to keep that. It's very valuable. Why do you talk down to me? I'm smart. I got a big brain. I know what's going on. 
I'm a pilot. I can fly. That's the coolest mechanic, play, whatever you want to call it. Open the door. How's the new cat doing? I never got a cat. I have. How's the new cat doing? I didn't have an old cat or get a new cat. Hey, Michelle. I never got a cat. <laughs> the hell. Oh, yeah, it's gonna. All the enemies. Normally, you know, there's a little bit of a. Well, I blocked that and I didn't. It didn't matter. <laughs> A lot of enemies have got a little stutter or an animation or a movement style or a some kind of frame that'll tell you when the attack's coming and <laughs> I'm not getting it yet. But I've only been playing the game for about 30 minutes. We'll get it. Also, I'm out of healing. Mr. Bigglesworth and Cheddar Biscuits. Now I've always had the cat Cheddar Biscuits. That's the lady's cat, not my cat, but you kind of adopt it, you know. It kind of comes with the territory. I love cats and dogs, but I'm much more of a cat person. I like cats because cats can be seen and not heard. I don't have the passcode. Dogs are loyal and good guard animals, but cats... I like a cat that... I don't have to know that it's alive to know that it's alive. You know what I mean? Like, every once in a while, it'll come out of a hole somewhere and say hi, and then it'll leave again. I like that. Appreciate you, cat. I didn't get the code from that guy? Darn it. No code for me. Facts? Yeah, that's how I like my cats to behave. I've got a dog, too. Don't get me wrong. I don't love my dog any less. You clip that? Why would you do that? <laughs> got him! Proof that he has a cat. I never said I didn't have a cat. I personally don't have a cat. She's got a cat. Trap. Yeah, it is. Ooh. You say trap. I say target rich environment. Let's do it, baby. Yeah, we might be in a little bit of trouble. I said hit the drum, but where is the drum? These things? Blow up, you asshole! God. Too late now! I knew one of those guys was going to come to life, and I have no healing whatsoever. Holy statue of no limitations. Wish I had a ranged weapon. That would be nice. Oh, shit! Oh! Shit! 
Jesus! I better back out. GG. We are in a little bit of trouble. I had to use every bit of my healing on this last little round of bad guys. Do and or buddy. Where was the dude at that was doing the scanning? Well, I don't want to leave before I get off my gold first. Secret item? Secret treasure! Oh, shit! I don't have any healing! Secret treasure! Not my problem. Good luck, guys. Hope you make it. I mean, there's no reason why I didn't make that jump. That was dumb. I like the music, but it is starting to get on my nerves. Classic Final Fantasy. Decades have passed since the appearance of Nayata Bas and the evacuation of humankind of the colony. They say the airborne squad is descending to rescue the remaining humankind, but there's no sign. Oh, we found the passcode, but I don't think that's the passcode of the other chest that we were looking at earlier. Speaking of chests, there's a nice chest. May I turn off the BG music? I may have to do that. Your poor Achilles? Ah, that'll be fine. It still hurts to this day. Every single time that I go to train or run, it still hurts. Oops. There we go. That music's a little a little loud. Stick still has the security code registered. It also has record of a message log. Scan complete. Scan complete. Go to the Hall of Records, okay? I'm sure it's right this way. It's even got platforming, guys. Where's my Assassin's Creed friends at? You have to cross here. 
You see the ladder behind me? Yeah. Can I jump in the water? Didn't jump in the water earlier kill me? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You love the music? Yeah, it's... It, oh, shit. What the hell was I doing? It's fine, but I've heard that same chorus. And we're an hour and one minute into the game. So more power to you if you can handle it. I'm a variety of spice of life kind of a guy. Says the dude that's listened to Creed since 1999. <laughs> yeah! I can't reach the ladder. The water level is too low. Try using the plank. Cool, sonar. Also, there's a human over there. I really need... You find it angelic? Well, that's okay. You can, you can watch whatever you want. I'm glad you enjoy it. Come on, healing stuff. No healing stuff. What's a girl got to do to get a freaking boo-boo bush? Healing spray. Anything. Hook me up. Okay, he said use a plank. This plank? That can't be how this works. $4.99 from Nick Van I suggest that wanted to hear Joe say this. Ball ball bottom dog one ball do bad do bad of dumbo. And he did. He accepted the challenge. He performed. And he overcome. Tribute! From Nick Van Sice. Tribute! Tribute! $19.99 from Scray 666 Creed is forever. You can't tell me. If you start hearing this at a bar, you're not going to stand up and start singing it. Everybody in that bar is going to stand up and be like, yeah, ah. rock and roll. Time and time again, here yeah, yeah. Let's go there. Hey, Robin. Sestina, thank you so much. Coming in hot with the 20 bones. Thank you so much for supporting the League of Blades. Thank you, Nick Vansize, for the five. Thank you, guys, for supporting the cause of justice. Hello, Robin. So hi, I'm a real soldier. Okay, what do we got? I definitely need some potions of, ouch, my boo-boos hurt. Uh, I, we could have grenades. Grenades are cool. No, Scotty, concentrate. You need, you need potions. Seven dollars from your dirty thoughts. Look at this photograph. <laughs> oh man, that's the only time I've ever seen Taylor Swift actually cringe on camera. She knew that was bad. Everybody knew that was bad. Uh, let's see here. Blessed burb clap ever. It actually was. Thank you very much to your dirty thoughts. Thank you for tribute. To the League of Blades. Tribute to justice. Thank you for being my hero, buddy. Thank you. 
Recharges beta energy. I wonder why they call it beta energy. If you're into that stuff. Beta, alpha, sigma, Charlie, delta. Uh, I'm not really digging much of these moves here. Increases the distance and attack of the power rush. Hold triangle, huh? Mm. The perfect dodge. I don't dodge much. Where's the blocking stuff? I'd rather block. Or parry. Hmm. That is a pretty extensive crazy... It's not like Path of Exile bad, but there's a lot going on. Okay, there's the perfect parry. Make it easier to perfect parry. Not enough Espa. Well, then we're saving our Espa then. I need more Espa. I need two Espa. I like that perfect parry. For the hungry off one beer under the world. Time and time again. Hey, yeah, yeah. So let's go there. That's about the most badass way I've ever seen somebody ride a ladder before. Empire State Building? That's how you ride a ladder. Eight dollars from your dirty thought search nerd a virgin dog. <laughs> we have to go through this building. <laughs> Try putting the fusion cell you have here. It's not a virgin dog. So this should this I think this is a checkpoint. It is. Or a shortcut. Short, shortcut. Back to back tributes. The awesome, your dirty thoughts. Thank you. You're welcome. That was a very well timed blurb. Can I please heal? Oh, I need to rest to heal. I think. I think. I haven't been resting. I think I'm supposed to rest. I think. Where was the rest spot here? Where the hell's the rest spot? I got turned around. I think if I take a nap in a chair, then I get health points back. If you want, I can turn the music up. I don't care. It don't bother me enough where I can't listen to it. Here we go. No? Where in the hell is the safe spot over here? I could have swore there was a safe spot over here. Well. I like this game. I'm enjoying it. So much nice job. Hey, buddy. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I'm enjoying having you here with us. Thank you. Also, once again, thank you so much for your dirty thought for the back-to-back -back super chats. Thank you very much. To Sestina. I thought I saw a guy there. Shit, I need... What was I thinking? There was a... There was a... Whatever, man. There was a place to heal right here. And you guys didn't say a word. Don't you okay me? Stop, stop it! Don't you okay me? You know what I'm thinking about? I'm thinking about how excited I am to watch X-Men 97 Episode 3 tonight. I'm also thinking about how awesome Shogun has been so far this season. How it's given me faith in television again, because it's been so long since I've seen a good TV show. 
What in the... Is that two people? Wow. His What the? His hand is a shield. I tried to dodge. It didn't work. Invincible. I've not seen the new season yet. Is it good? What the hell? Three hits? I'm guessing whenever I sit up here at this save zone. And give it that and let my tongue hit the latex and it vibrates it. I'm not pushing real hard. I'm pushing just enough so their latex is giving it that and that's what you're trying to You know what I really respect? The women that get into those latex outfits. You know how hard it is to walk around in pure rubber? The dedication that it takes that you to slide into one of them things. And then the sensation of wearing one of those. That, to me, just absolutely would be a nightmare. You're always watching old sitcoms? Same. I'm watching Seinfeld... Everybody loves Raymond. Yeah. Home improvement. I get it. The monster does come back every time we heal, just like Elden Ring. Okay. Good night, Nicole. Nicole, I have no idea why the thing's not picking your alerts out. Oh, but I like see you, and I know you, and I love you. Thank you, Nicole. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Sort of. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. What a waste of resources. You watch a lot of shows on the Food Network? Ted? How do I put this? My dream is to... And somebody said it's available out there somewhere. My dream is to get the entire diners, drive-ins, and dives checklist. Like of every state. And go visit them and eat there. And take a picture of me being there. So that I can do the entire triple D quest? Adventure? What, what would we call that? Hentai monster? <laughs> I'm blocking, damn it. That line will take months. There's one from North Carolina. I don't know if there's one, you know what I mean? Like a, a universal checklist where you can just kind of like a, a triple D challenge. Challenge thinks the right word. There is one from North Carolina. Everywhere that he's visited North Carolina, you can get a list of it online and go visit it yourself. Scotty wants a high five. Oh, I would love to high five Guy Fieri. I think Guy Fieri is one of the coolest dudes. When I first ever saw him, ever, I was like, look at this douchebag with his frosted tips. <laughs> but he's a really cool dude. I still don't like his fashion sense, quite deep. but I respect it. To pass. We'll have to go across, past the parking tower. Okay. He said the same thing. I still don't like his fashion sense, but I respect it. Like, I, I like that he stands out. 
It's not how I would dress, and I don't particularly like it. But it's his brand. If he ever got rid of his frosted tip, I don't know what I would do. I wouldn't recognize him. I wouldn't know who, who we're talking about. I wouldn't know that was Guy Fieri. He has to have that hairdo. Eve is protected by a shield. Eve has damage reduction while the shield is active, and the damage reduction increases as the shield protection level increases. All right. Some enemies are also protected by a shield. Enemies have damage reduction. I can parry that? No, apparently not. I can't dodge that, damn it! Hell yeah. Adam, what is this? Don't you know this already? Insects versus Resident Evil? A map. How do you synchronize the location on the map? Why are you being so impatient with our girl? I'll kick your ass, Adam. Nobody messes with Scotty's angels. Finger books. One, two, three, two, two, three. Oh, it's just some kind of dumb book. <laughs> it's just some kind of dumb book. I love book, and I love lore. But that had nothing to do with anything. That was just a random excerpt. Yoink. They're still playing that same music. Finger bangs. You know it. See this guy right here? He don't think I know that he's evil. Or that he's a bad guy. I didn't get that skill where I can stab him in the back. Maybe if we leave him alone, he won't transform. Need a game like this, but takes place under the sea. Under the sea. Full of wealthy. There's nothing wetter. That where it's better. Leave it to me. Lots of dead bodies and big bugs. A supply camp. In a place like this. Supply camp? What's that? It's, it's a supply a camp. Set up by the airborne squad who came here before. Hmm. His name's Adam. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp also serves as an You know what's sad? Place. My titties also Is jiggle when I walk around. Lot important? It could also mean... This place is very dangerous. Then I guess this place could be useful for us. Is that Stu? Hell yeah. Supply camps feature more devices than regular camps. Money don't jiggle jiggle. It folds. I like to see you wiggle wiggle. For sure. I make you want to dribble dribble. You know, ride it in my fear. You really have to see it. Supply camps feature more devices than regular camps. You can use the <laughs> you can use the repair console. Tribute. Ten dollars from Living Sandman. Finger bang, finger bang. Tribute has been made to this night, to this adventure, to this cause of spreading justice in our robot lady ninja world of awesome monsters and combat. Thank you.
for that tribute. Thank you for supporting the League of Blades. And thank you to Livin' Sandman for the 10 bones. So very good to see you, my friend. Welcome back to the show. Those ocean fish that live in the total pitch black are what horror dreams are about. Yeah. How cool would it be if Cthulhu was actually real? And that he was a space monster that fell to the bottom of the ocean and was just laying there? You upgrade your drone, craft nano suits, and fast travel. Alright. Coin. Sure, we must be struggling. Yeah, not doing great. It ain't hard. I watch it. Sorry. Terrifyingly cool. That's right. What the hell? Uh, yeah. Colonel, I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dummy thick, and the clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. Not the guards. Uh, we can, uh, increase our attack power enhancement. Attack power increased. Nice. Have you found any revealing waifu outfits? No, but trust me. I'm looking. I'm looking real hard. I can't stand the music in this game. <laughs> Not a fan. Not a fan. All right. We got a healing potion, basically. Do I have two skill points to help with my perfect dodge? I do. The perfect dodge. Perfect parry. Select blink. It won't let me learn it. Let me learn it, damn it. There's a skin suit. Let me learn it. Oh, it's making me pick a... It's making me pick this. Well, that's about some bullshit. What up, Mike? The skin suit increased the difficulty you have to pay to be a perv? Really? Are you calling me a perv? Press forward and circle when Eve's sword glows to move the target's rear and counterattack. Okay, that didn't work. You're from Western Australia? We love the Australians. Welcome, my friend. Okay. What's up, Benjamin? Yesterday, thank you for saving me. You doing your thing, you blading? I am. It's nothing really. 
though I have used up almost all of the exospine materials that I collected over the years. Hmm. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. I want the skin suit. Tell me how to get the skin suit. I want the skin suit. We can track down the Alpha Nativa together. And, well, I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. Perfect game for your page? I think so. You'll have done more than enough. Are you calling me a perv? <laughs> Listen, don't worry. I promise. I'll make sure to repay you. Get the skin suit. How do I get the skin suit? Stop insulting me and start helping me. How do I get it? You ain't a man if you don't get the skin suit. How do I get it? No blades in the title? Pretty sure it, it actually says blades in the title. Where's the skin suit? I want the skin suit. I'm not seeing a skin suit. I pushed every button. But I'm not seeing skin suit. Skin suit finds you. <laughs> okay. Well, titty winkle. Unequip your current outfit. I can do that. Nice. I mean, we got to see how she controls and how the gameplay is. Yeah, we got to try out the gameplay. We got to see if it actually affects our ability to slay evil. Who said that? Look. It's the gaping dragon from Dark Souls. Gaping dragon. Oh crap. Adam, get back. Okay, I'm gonna put my suit back on. Is that cool? <laughs> Oh, I can't change my equipment during battle. All right, we're doomed. You guys are gonna get me killed! I am trying to block it ain't working. You have no shielding? Perfect. Hey, I got him halfway down by just being butt naked. Not bad. Scotty died for our sins. <laughs> and I do it again just for you. All right. Time to get pumped up. We got to bring some justice up here, baby. Hello, Andrew. Here we go! What's up, Ryan? 
been a while. Hope you're doing good, buddy. Look. You're just in time, Ryan. This fight is for you, buddy. Damn it, Ryan! Ryan! That was that last time. To me. Something serious seems to have happened. I have to return to Zion. Oh my goodness. It's full of plants and little birds. Y'all see how good I'm doing? Y'all see how good I was doing? Well, remember how I said there was no big games coming out between now and Elden Ring? Wrong. We're picking this up next month. You bet your sweet ass. You bet your sweet ass. The League of Blades will leave... That was stellar. The League of Blades will leave our mark all over this game. You better believe we're going to be getting this thing. Hell yeah. Hey, Tom. Hell yeah. That was awesome. That was a solid 10 out of 10 quality. Yeah, absolute quality. Ooh, what's the boss challenge? Quality. It's like this, these people know what kind of game I want to play. 
The rail yard? Nice. Wow. Whoa! Ah. <laughs> this thing's called a stalker. Well, so much for doing my forward blink attack. get railed and she did she got a flannel outfit i'm trying to use all of her new moves that she's got i got like seven or eight new moves on there or not seven or eight three or four new combinations down the bottom right Ten dollars from Jared Magic Man Johnson. Tribute has been made. Thank you so much. To the Magic Man himself, baby. That's right, baby. Get in them guts. This is his second form. He's pissed. It hurt me so much. He's basically fucking one shotting me. Shouldn't have hit me. How's your arm swollen? God bless. What a combo at the end. Jared at Magic Man. Thank you, my friend. Thank you for the 10 bones. Thanks for the tribute.
Oh yeah, tattoo session four hours yesterday. What kind of tattoo did you get? I bet you something video game related. He walloped me on that one. Why am I not blocking? Ooh. I gotta find out a move that can close the distance better. And that's how he got me. <sighs> Who'd have thought that throwing a temper tamper would have been what got me? All right. We do have a horror game to play tonight. And uh, we'll play it. Right. I'm going to try this one more time. Because I'm starting to get the game hang. over. Skill issue. <laughs> we got it. We got it. No problem. Yeah, like the purple prompts. I've not seen those yet in the game. I don't know what purple prompts mean. on a cop oh yeah there has never been a boss that we haven't defeated before we got it you know it's bad fix it that long to get up That's a cool move. Oh, 
We about got it, guys. Yeah! Oh, shit. Mama needs a new pair of gators. Woo! Not just a fish. Nine dollars ninety nine cents from total revenue to that guy. And that's the bottom line because Blaze says so. <laughs> that's right. You bet your sweet ass it's the bottom line because the League of Blades said so. Tribute! A hero gives tribute to the League of Blades. That was a badass boss fight. We got him. We got him. Thank you so much. To as Biden said, to tell Thank you very much. Let's see what Scotty Blaze has been playing recently on his PlayStation. Oh, Dragon's Dogma, Stellar Blade, Hell Divers, God of War, God of War, Disney's Pixar Up, Bolt, Toy the Toy Story. Man eater, he may or may not have a young boy. <laughs> yes, the best games. The best games. All right. Let's get this uh horror game going. A new one. A new horror game for the League of Blades. Go figure. If I can switch monitors and my stream doesn't crash. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Oh, everything's fine. Disney? Oh, no. I'd, uh... I don't really care if it's Disney or not, but they were. They were all games that my boy picked up and played. Thank you to everybody who has sent Super Chat tonight or liked or laughed or lurked or hung out, came for some rest and relaxation or got involved in the action. This game has got a lot of extensions. There it goes. Production! Ah, oh, we're fine. Man Eater's a fun game. It is. If you've ever wanted to be a secret tunnel, if you've ever wanted to be a shark eating people, the sensation of eating large animals and attacking boats, or just being a shark, just being a cool and swimming around in the ocean. No BMX triple X. Not on my PlayStation. My boy plays my PlayStation. But on uh on Daddy's Steam Deck. <laughs> I play all the triple X games so you don't have to. Safe search is off of my Steam search. But not on my computer. And also not on my business account. My personal account. <laughs> My personal account, not my business account. And my personal computer, not my business computer. Don't ever mix business with pleasure. Because then you'll have shit pop up. And you won't know what to say. This game's not appropriate for people with heart diseases. That doesn't make any sense. Wait. We've played this stupid game before. Because I remember this intro. I remember this intro. Oh, 
Bad news for me, I'm not half PlayStation. You can't play Stellar Blade. Oh no! Well, live vicariously through me, Dragon Shadow. My name is Mark. After graduating from college and serving in the army, I decided to join the police force. It seemed like a good idea. Thanks to my dad, I was able to get an interview and start working. My happiness was unbelievable. That's what I say every day. My happiness is unbelievable. But I didn't know yet what was ahead of me. La, 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 la. Check the coffee. Check the coffee? Coffee? It's not letting me touch anything. Hmm. So far, it's too hot. Okay. Hey! Jesse! I want to remind you about the paperwork. They're on the table. Please deal with them today. Okay. I'll come and get them tomorrow. You got it. I can do all that. Thanks. Bye-bye. Paperwork. Oh, yo! That's a lot of paper. Hope I don't forget. I could keep up with that. Only weird people say yo. Whoa. Aren't those pictures on the wall of actual serial killers? Giant warehouse fire ravages city street. Woo. I'm almost done with the ad. Very dangerous killer. Why is it going so fast? What do you want, fatty? What are you doing? I'm trying to type a report. Your boss is sending you on a business trip. Dave? Are you stupid? I almost crapped my pants. You probably heard. Dot, dot, dot. This looks like a different game. Since people left. There's a man coming to give you a car soon. You have to go to Radford. That's where I went to college. If you have any questions, text me. If you're just joining the broadcast once again, uh, Stellar Blade, which was a stellar game, it was only a demo. The actual full game does not come out for another month. But we like the demo. We like the demo so much, we're probably going to get the demo and play it here on the channel. We give the demo 10 out of 10, but it was a demo, and it's only an hour and a half, and now we're playing a new game. And this game is called People in the Dark. Gloom Valley. I gotta go get another beer. So you guys can watch a cool... Let me get through this sentence first so we can turn the music down. Okay, I'll let you know when I get there. Stop at a gas station and a coffee shop. Interview people. All right, come on. <laughs> here I go. On the evening of the same day, there was a knock at my door. I looked through the peephole and saw a man. He must be the one who should rent me the car. I got dressed and went outside. Dot, dot, dot. 13 o'clock. There he is. No chats. <laughs> You're doing amazing, sweetie. Thank you. I'm going to go get a beer. Never fear. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Yeah, bums. Deep within the Sahara Desert, in the land that Arab beckons, 
Gothic Custom Shop. Ladies and gentlemen, we present to you this week's giveaway. The wondrous artifacts and properties. Whoops. The gin jar. Bless you. That's right, folks. This jar within holds a genie. Two holy missions. FBI, open up! Scotty, he's one for a burger one time. In order to access this incredible property, rub firmly on the side of the face. No, don't do that. Oh, God, his eyes. What a wonderful cultured people the Rabbikians are. They taught Scotty so much. Here it is, folks. There you go. Be sure to enter this giveaway. Bye. Found inside the cave of a troll in a land lost in time on an earth not quite up, not quite down, but somewhere in the middle. Ladies and gentlemen, we bring you one of the seven seeing stones of Palantir. That, yeah, that thing, that obsidian, yeah, Palantir. There it is. Whether you're scrying on your enemies or using it to, to speak to another world entity in order to do the bidding of the dark wizard, or if you're just trying to use it to figure out what the menu of Taco Bell is this week, but you can't go outside because of quarantine, you know, it might get overused will give you the wizard. Stop typing notify. Those because you, it's a fever, man, and there's no magical cure for that. You could use it to uh, try to orchestrate the overtaking of the entire universe and the world. And do that by orchestrating the constitutional making of uh, incredible mutated Urukai orc creatures for the betterment of evil. Or you could use it for good. You know, whatever you're into, man, just really, just it's for you. Right there it is. The Palantir, one of the rare seven stones. Okay, tune in. Type notify. Bye. Don't type notify. How does this game... I can't believe they chose Shia LaBeouf over Scotty. I know. <laughs> no! <laughs> notify! <laughs> I thought they were trying to say no, Tiffy. What did Tiffy do to you? Bitch, she broke my heart. I don't know. How does this game know about this stream? What? No chat? We have a very active community. You know what's crazy about a lot of streams? A lot of streams that you go into, there's a lot of people watching and nobody's talking. Nobody's talking to the streamer. The streamer's not talking to them. It's just quiet and the person's playing the game. Ain't that weird? Ain't that weird? God, I love pizza and bacon and food choice tomatoes and burgers and steaks that without a plate just laying on the table and olive oil and burgers with no buns i love my house turn off notify that's right Nerd affair. is that his mouth open it is hey is that you mark yes then hold the key Okay, okay. Your boss rented a car from me. All right. Oh, yeah. The lease. Have any of you guys ever leased a car before? I wonder where you're going. None of your business. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> I heard his feelings. Scotty Firewater? That was racist. <laughs> Scotty Firewater? That was racist as hell. Have you leased many cars? Do you like leasing cars? Green bean casserole? I had... I figured you'd lease cars, Ted. That seems like right up your alley. I got a new text message from somebody. Hey, Margaret, somebody's comments aren't showing up. Who? Brian can't see Dan, whatever. Oh no, Scotty's driving in a video game again. I'm not a bad.
You can't lease a car when you drive 30,000 miles a year. I got an uncle who's in sales. He sells chemicals. He sells the chemical that goes in Lysol. He loves his job. He, he sells chemicals that go in Lysol. Your company gave you a car to sell stuff? What? If you don't mind me asking, okay, you don't have to tell me. But I've never actually, I've never actually asked. You're always working or at a motel. What do you actually sell? Wish this music would shut up. Your chat's been F for a while now? What's going on with YouTube chat? I'm sorry, guys. I couldn't even edit my stream earlier. You sell building materials? Cool. To like big construction companies? All good to you? Good. Where's my gas tank? Get together, YouTube. It's YouTube's not been. YouTube's been very glitchy for even me. Even me. I have a super dangerous chemical in my garage. My, my uncle actually sells chemicals to Lysol. Apparently, Lysol does not have all the chemicals they need to make Lysol in-house. So he sells the chemical that goes in Lysol. And he travels all over the world. He's always staying in like Chicago, New York, and Atlanta. And he's got a big-ass house here in North Carolina. That's how I met Chris Daltrey. I lived with him for a little while, and he was neighbors with Chris Daughtry. I've met and talked to Chris Daughtry several times. I swam in his pool <laughs> a bunch. Engineering wood, laminated veneer lumber. Do you like wood? Don't you kind of have to like something to want to sell it? You know what I mean? Hi! You dated Chris Daughtry? Yes, that's what I said. All of his songs about breakups are about me. And I crashed in the earth. <laughs> and I went up in flames. Could have been with blades again. But he went and found another man. <laughs> Come here. Whoa. Hello. Zach Galifianakis is cooler. Yeah, he's cooler. Chris Douche. Chris Douche. I about called him Chris Douche. Douche Street. Chris Daughtry's kind of turned into a little bit of a douchebag. Hello. Hey, do you know what's going on in Radford? Scotty broke his heart. <laughs> he won't swim in my pool no more. You grew up in hardwood lumber business? Oh. So you, you know all about some wood. <laughs> like two years ago, I had ADT security softwares approach me and try to recruit me to be a salesman for the ADT sales, whatever. I'm, I'm like, if I'm going to sell something, I, I want to like it. If somebody wants to break into your house, there's nothing you can do. As a guy who worked home invasions and violent robberies and violent crimes, if somebody wants to get in your house, there's no amount of security. So I'm not going to go in here like, Oh, yeah, you and your family's totally safe with ADT security software. If somebody breaks into your home, trust me, ADT's going to call, then some guy's going to be on a speaker. Ma'am, somebody has activated the living room security sequence measurements. Are you okay? Can you please give me the nine-digit code in order to... By that point, the person that's came in there to do you harm has done stuck a machete in your back. Couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Nothing. And I'm not from around here. 
What are you so nervous about? Plenty of people will sell things they don't like. Pop a security system. Lots of guns. That's my recommendation. When people were afraid for their lives and like, you cops can't be around all the time, what should I do? Buy a gun. If they break into your home and they come after you and they try to hurt you, put two rounds in them. One in their face and one in their heart so they'll never forget who you are. That's not professional legal advice. I'm just making a skit and I'm doing a little bit. That's not professional advice. Don't shoot people, people. Hi. Can I give you a hint? Gasoline, tires, oil. I'll have 15 liters of 92 gasoline, please. Don't raise alarms, just fire arms. You're telling. <laughs> Your number one column. You owe $10. There you go. And you must be in Radford. That's where I'm at. Whoa. Just the other day, my brother came to visit. He works as a security guard at Radford Forest. ADT will alert us when they do. Yeah, ADT will tell your story. Killed a guard from the tower and went missing. Uh-oh. The police have gotten so lax. They're all ineffective. So I'm worried. I'm sorry to burden you with my problems. Good luck in Radford. In Canada, thanks to my leader, if I would go to jail for hurting the criminal... Things got so twisted and crooked and sideways in law enforcement with people Monday quarterbacking violent situations, I got out. My job was pure violence. They sent me after the worst of the worst people, and I had the worst luck, and I got into the most shit, and I am so blessed and lucky to be alive. So, the way I looked at it, fate rolled its dice so many times, and I got out of it so many times. What's up, Jaggy Laggy? How are you? I'm here for a bit. We'll take you as long as we can. Thanks for answering the blade signal. Welcome to the show. Whoops. Where's the guard station? Go straight down the highway for about 20 kilometers. You'll see a gate. And a cabin on the right. These NPCs talk like Captain Kirk. Is that the NPC's fault or is that my fault? Sniff his butt. Sniff his butt. Sniff his butt. Or her butt. It's butt. Sniff it. Yes! I should go to the bathroom. Alright, where's the bathroom? I don't want to do it yet. I don't want to do it yet. I mean, I'm sure people go bathroom back here. A mix of both. Papa Cake Security. The children will run. <laughs> now, I, I hated telling people that. What should I do? Because people would come in for protective orders, and I'm like, you do understand that a protective order is just a piece of paper. It means nothing. You can't hold it up and scare the guy off. If he's there to do harm to you, there's nothing that's going to stop that person from doing harm to you. I'm sorry. You can get all the paperwork you want. Paperwork won't stop bad people from doing bad things. There's somebody in the bathroom. I hear rustling. Get out! What do you want? Hey, Go take a walk. How long will you be in there? Yeah! Go away or I'll stab you. Yeah, that's why you don't mess people inside of Porta Johns. Okay, all right, I'll pee my pet.
tip it over. I appreciate your honesty and hard work stopping. I used to do all that stuff. And I was, and still am, just brutally honest. I just tell you how it is. I don't fluff it. Push it over. I'm trying. I have the same idea you guys did. It won't let me. This game looks very familiar. You play in the past in the supernatural game. They a small village where they burned witch and a child. You talking about Little Hope? One of the dark anthology pictures games. The game told me to do something after that guy told me to heal stab me, but I didn't read it. So I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Oh, pop, pop, pop in the gas. Visiting a gas station left a bad impression on me. Did they take two separate games we played and make a new one? I don't know. I know this game would just release a couple days ago, but remember the intro of this game? The dude standing by the fire and the music playing? We played that game before, but I don't remember any of this. None of this. These NPCs, the interaction, the dialogue, nothing. Visiting a gas station left a bad impression on me. People I saw for the first time threatened me. Especially strange was the man in the store. He got worried when I asked him for directions to the farm. Have we played a demo of it? Maybe. Maybe he's involved in disappearing people. I don't know. The important thing was I got to Radford. I had a nice dinner at the local cafe. The staff were friendly to me. I went outside and had a conversation. Oh, the intro is the same as the one Dragon Shadow talked about. Okay. I went outside and had a conversation, a conversation that shaped my life. Dot, dot, dot. It might have been a demo. I have to eat the donut before it gets cold. Eat it. I don't know how to check my messages. When I push tab, it starts the game over. Q, W, E, R, 1, 2, 3, middle click, T, Y, space, Z, X, C. Oh, here we go. Interview the people. Find out if you haven't seen... Find out if you... Just got a call from a girl. <laughs> she claims she was attacked. She barely escaped with her life. Get out as soon as you can. I'll text you the address. Try not to hesitate. Do you pick your own hours, Ted, or do you have to work what the company tells you to work? Okay, I'll be right here. Okay. Stay in touch. Okay. Right after Dave sent me the address, what is up with this camera? The scene was an abandoned meat packing plant. The mill used, but after the crisis, the mill was closed and the employees were fired. A lot of people weren't happy about it. Started protests attacking police officers. People had no money to feed their families. Dot, dot, dot. Set your own schedule? That's not bad. It's a strange thing. Still can't find the killer. Maybe there's more than one. I got to visit the farm and the mill. The only thing I know, all the murders take place in the woods near the farmhouse. I thought something was wrong. Like something, 
I don't know how to explain it. After the accident. Oh, I was in an accident. I got split in headaches. Uh-oh. The dialogue's too fast. I can't keep up with it. Nothing good ever happens after an accident. Here, yeah, spooky, spooky, woo, woo, monster. Ooh, I may have had the volume too low, and you guys didn't hear this person scream bloody murder in the background. What the fuck? Somebody somewhere screamed bloody murder. Oh my god. Who the heck is that? I can't chase after him. Tried. Blinking, you missed it? Yeah, no kidding. Unknown text message. Hello, yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Who are you? Isn't yeah, yeah Hispanic for ha ha? The sign says stop. My heart says go. Yaya Spanish for grandma? They called me a grandma? Well, you guys call me a grandpa. I look you. Let's play. Fuck you, cheater. Five dollars from George or Don Do. Papa Blades for president. I'm running on a platform. And that platform is simple. A battle axe in every hand and a boob in every face. We're talking pizza vouchers. Every day, you turn in your voucher, you get a pizza. International, government-provided pizza. Everybody gets pizza, but if you don't turn your voucher in, it expires on that day. So you can't turn in 10 vouchers and then throw a party and have a big pizza voucher party. One pizza voucher a day, 24 hours, bam. Also, if I'm president, there will be a Dunkin' Donuts that is open 24 seven so that you can go get a delicious donut and or breakfast treat because they serve breakfast all day long. You can get a good cup of coffee at three o'clock in the morning because my biggest pet peeve when I was working surveillance and or driving back from an operation somewhere, was wanting to have a delicious cup of coffee to keep me awake at three o'clock in the morning and none of the coffee machines were fresh because nobody makes coffee at three o'clock in the morning. That's my promise to you. A battle ax in every hand, a boob in every face, pizza vouchers every single day, and Dunkin' Donuts that stay open 24 seven. It's thanks to tributes from heroes like George, Ariadondo, that I will be able to run on this platform of beards, biceps, and battle axes. Thanks to you. Can I trade the voucher for a BTGC? No. <laughs> no. Uh, key? I need a gray key. Well, I got it. You got my vote? Thanks. That's an inspirational speech. You inspired me.
We need to check the house. Maybe there's somebody there. This isn't a house. It's a shack with an axe and a pig head and a crowbar. When the election comes, can you put my name on the ballot? You can. You absolutely can. You know what's sad? Ross Perot can't run for president. Is Bernie Sanders running for president again, or did he decide to quit? Corpse. We need to text Dave. Calling a team of investigators. Dave? You think Bernie's done? <laughs> Dave! I mean, Bernie! Bernie stopped? No! Bernie! Well, he gave it a good shot. I'm going to miss all those memes of him sitting in a jacket wearing mittens with his arms crossed and his legs crossed. Come back. I'll never forget you, Burns. I am once again asking. You guys don't understand. The country is about to be put into the hands of a douchebag and a turd sandwich. I went inside and I found nothing. Except for a bloody knife. Someone must have been here. While I was looking around the room, a silhouette appeared in the window. Uh-oh. It was rapidly approaching the door. Uh-oh. I started to panic. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. I feel really bad. I don't know what to say. They took me somewhere. And thrown in a little room. I'm creepy. <laughs> that is some Oscar worthy grade A dialogue. I'm creepy. I'm creepy. That one says, I kill you. Now, this guy right here, he's seen better days. Can you hear me? Hello? Uh, uh, he's here. Ah, he's here. Who? Whoever the last guy I was here was playing solitaire. Top secret, solitaire. I'm creepy. I kill you. I don't know why I gotta keep sighing. I need a blue key, okay? Okay. Good luck, man. I'll never forget you. If I have played three horror games every night for the last three years, and you know, sometimes I take a day off a week 
a, like a full day with no activity whatsoever. So let's say that I have played 320 days out of the year, three different games. So 320, and some nights it's been more than that. Let's just say 320. times three that's 960 games that I play on any given year and I've been doing this for the last four years but the first year I played mostly Resident Evil so let's say 960 times three we have played almost 3,000 indie horror games on this channel a lot that's your estimate for one day off a week yeah I, I generally take one full day off a week a mallet Somebody had, somebody's hemorrhoid exploded. Also, I think I accidentally dropped that hammer. I did. When that day Papa goes to wrestle bears in the woods, I really do disconnect. I completely tried to unplug. I didn't realize how unhealthy it was for me to be as plugged into the internet as I was all the time, always. The internet's great, it's how we all met. But just like the Matrix, you gotta unplug from the Matrix. You can't stay in the Matrix, you'll lose yourself. I was so plugged into the internet constantly that I was starting to lose myself. So I've been really not doing anything internet related when I'm off at all much happier it's a lot of dead people in this place <laughs> but at least he's smiling you guys see that photo what's the name of the dude that was in ghostbusters ernie hudson Did you see that photo of ernie hudson how he looks today he's not aged a bit and the Ghostbuster movies were 40 years ago? Getting close to being 50 years ago. He's not aged a bit. kind of dumb <laughs> need hammer I just had a hammer Gives you a reflection? Nah, buddy. The people who get on the internet and get mad are the 5% of the human population that are so bored with their own lives that they have to try to find some kind of meaning or use or power online where they think their opinion matters. 95% of people are too busy doing 
important stuff to get on the internet and yell about shit. Making medicine, practicing law, building things. I don't have time to go on the internet and go, You need to put on more clothes. You look like a whore. Okay. <laughs> and your opinion means what, how, when? My opinion is my opinion matters. As long as you think that, that's all that matters, buddy. I just had a great key. Where was the key I just had? See how hard it is to be excited about these kind of games after you play a game like Dragon's Dogma or Stellar Blade? And somehow I'm fucking stuck. You made me come in this hole, game! You made me! I don't want to come in this hole! I bet you one of the keys was in one of these pigs or something.
never played Doom, the first one. I understand the references and the jokes and stuff, but I never played it. I never played the original Doom, I played the new one. Whenever I think of Doom, I think of the old... The old one, not the new stuff. They're too hyper for me, too much stimulation. Walk down the narrow wooded path, I didn't have a sense of loneliness. Can I get one of those famous Scotty Blades birthday songs for your 41st birthday today? Absolutely! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dearest Cooter Slayer. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, booty. Booty. You said Duke Nukem and I combined buddy with booty. Happy birthday, booty. The only thing reassured me that there was a road nearby. Happy birthday, booty. Care a lot about you. Happy birthday, booty. Oh, I hate horror games, man. Ew, buddy. Zombie games are totally different. I like zombie games. Horror games, the trope is just make it as dark as possible. <laughs> How dark can we make it? Dark is scary, right? Zombie games. Hell, we played Dead Island. That took place in a sunny downtown metropolis. Lord have mercy. <laughs> Nobody tells Papa Blake what to do. Managed to escape after everything has happened to me. I went to the police station to see Dave. After telling what had happened, I could totally watch you pl please play some more dogma. Oh, I played dogma all day today. I'm all about some dogma, man. We'll be playing Dogma again tomorrow. Uh, I won't be taking tomorrow off like normal. We will be streaming tomorrow during the daytime, playing some more Dogma. He called me crazy and told my supervisor everything. Yeah, we'll play some Dogma tomorrow. He called me crazy, yeah. I was fired the same day and wanted to go to the hospital. You really like Dogma? Oh, me too. I've loved Dogma. After a while, the case was never solved. Only I knew the truth in the real situation. Murders continue in Radford. People live in constant fear. If this is the end of the game, this game sucks. There's a murder on the loose. The midnight hour is upon us. Graveyard crew. Moon's out, goons out. Pull out your green lanterns. I 
after 20 years. Plants and factories opened and wrapped and jobs were created. This game sucks. The city began to prosper, but not for me. Everything that there lives in my soul. I can't forget anything. That was awful. That was awful. <laughs> the English was broken. The scares were dumb. Nothing happened. The dialogue was pathetic. Man, that was awful. That's a bad taste in my mouth. That is not get no, that does not get my seal of approval. I can't make games. But I could have made a better game than this. La 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 Bad review time? Oh, Papa Sleepy. Where did I get this from? I wonder what will happen next. Nice game. Looking forward to your next project. Such a strange experience. First game was odd. This one up that strangeness. I'm glad I played it, but I also have no idea what I what I did play. <laughs> I also found a bug. I got stuck in the area where the gray key was. So did I. This feels like fears to fathom. I saw the second one you did. Want to play this one? The only thing I had a problem with was the text and sensitivity. All right. Uh, these these reviews pale in comparison to what Pop was capable of. Prepare yourselves. It's time for a Blade review. Dear Dev, hi, it's Papa Poo Poo Pants, the other cool Papa. I'm not gonna leave a link to my YouTube channel. No one cares. Is that how you spell no one? As for this game, is my review. What? What? Such classic quotes. Creepy. 
again. I kill you. You will forever find a place in my cheese burger in Gord Park. I love you, not your game. Take care. Bye bye. The sharpest blade in the chest. It's kitchen. Draw. Scotty Boo Boos. <laughs> Scotty Boo Boos. Very good. Oh. All right, well, we're done. Be back tomorrow. Be back tomorrow with uh, Dragon's Dogma. Yes, I seem to have lost my YouTube page. All right, bye bye. Take care. <laughs> Thank you, everybody else, for my heroes tonight. But I can't find my YouTube page has disappeared. I can't see my stream. But I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow, Dragon's Dogma. I know I don't really off on Saturdays, but I'll be streaming tomorrow around noon or one. We're we'll playing some Dragon's Dogma. Bye bye now.